ขอให้เปิดกล้องนะคะรัพัสดรธรรมทัศพานุพงศ์ Open your camera ลืมครับโอเค All right. Good morning, students. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. A very good morning. How are you today, all of you students? I'm fine. You're fine. All of you are fine. Healthy. Happy. Yep. All right. So. Today our class is about subject uh, reading, right? So, do you have your books with you already? Yes. Okay. Okay, so today we are going to read unit number two. Unit number two, friends. Okay, so I want you to open your book, page number eleven. So. Today we are going to start review the old unit. Okay, so first of all, we are going to read, and then I would like the, the students to read uh, along with me as well, and then we will follow towards some of the questions and answers. Okay. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> first of all. Uh, Page number eleven. Here you can see we are given some of the pictures. Four of the pictures. Each pictures they show different uh, uh, expressions, right? So we having four different uh, sentences given to us. So each sentence is actually match a, a single picture. Okay. So we have to match. Uh, all the picture with the given sentences. Mm -hmm. All right, students, you are ready. Ready. Okay. So yeah. before we match uh, the pictures with the sentence, first of all, we are going to read uh, the sentences which are given to us. So sentence A is give some Sipa. of your things to your friends. B. Don't leave your friends. B two one. Sentence C. Three. Be kind and oh. friendly. Sentence D. Do things for your friends. Okay. So now i repeat one more time sentence a given to us is give some of your things to your friends b don't leave your friends c be kind and friendly d do things for your friends okay so now look at the pictures and can you tell me picture number one? What is the best match sentence for picture number one? A. I think A. A. Okay. Now, let me ask from another student. Oh. I lock your answer. <laughs> I lock down your answer. All right. Now, any other student? Picture number A. Picture number one. Three. C, right? So here we can see to uh, uh, now uh, we can look to the picture. A girl, she's holding her dog. So which means 
The girl is kind, right? So, picture number one, match C. Be kind and friendly. Okay. Now, picture number two. Who is going to answer? Me. Okay, go ahead. Picture number two, match. B. B. Don't leave your friends. Okay, I lock down your answer. Let me uh, ask from did. one, another student. Who can answer another student? B. B or D. <laughs> Let me. Okay. All right. Let me ask one by one. Okay. Uh, Matun, can you answer me number two picture? It match. Students, please close down your microphone. Let me ask from student so he have to answer. Okay. All right. Nan, close your microphone. Nan, close your microphone. All right. Let me ask from Matum. Can you answer picture number two? What is the best match of sentence? Don't leave your friend. Go. Ben. Picture number two, match. Yes. Uh, your answer, please, again. Picture number. Picture number two, two match, sentence A, B, C, D, which one? Picture number two. Yes, but it match which sentence? A, B, or D? B. D. Exactly. That is the correct answer. You can see here, <clears throat> uh, the, the boy, they help his friend. Okay, so do things for your friends. Now, picture number three. Let me ask from... Me. You already answer. Wait, wait for your turn again. Let me ask from you. You can you answer picture number three match which sentence? A. A. That is the correct answer. Give some of your things to your friends. Now picture number four. <laughs> Picture number four is match with B, right? So don't leave your friends. You can see here. So always be with the friend. Okay, so these are the match. Uh, pick matching picture with the sentences, which is more suitable for them. Okay, students, you already write down. All right, so now reading time. <laughs> here, we having, uh, here we having a poem given to us. Okay, so we are going to read. Uh, I tell yes. close to my, your microphone. I tell Student, please close down your microphone. Okay, thank you. Okay, student, so here we are given a poem. Okay, so we are going to read the poem first and then try to understand what they are talking about in this poem. And then we have answer, uh, we having some of the questions which we are going to answer according to the poem. Okay, all right, students, you ready? So <laughs> the poem start. The poem is about my friend. My friend is the title of the poem, okay? My friend's name is Petty. He always say, I want to eat. He's very funny and makes me laugh. He loves 
to dance down the garden path. He has ever so many friends. <clears throat> he never knows when play time ends. He lives at the bottom of my street. So every day in the morning at eight, we meet. We ride to school on our mountain bikes. And on Facebook, we have lots of likes. He'll stay with me until the end. He really is a true friend. Okay, now let me read one more time. Then we are going to try to understand what are they talking about in this poem. My friend's name is Petty. Uh, he always say I want to eat. He's very funny and makes me laugh. He loves to dance in the garden. He loves to dance down the garden path. He has ever so many friends. He never knows when play time ends. He lives at the bottom of my street. So every day in the morning at eight, we meet. We ride to school on our mountain bikes. And on Facebook, we have lots of likes. He'll stay with me until the end. He really is a true friend. Okay, so in this poem, uh, they're talking about his friend. So the friend's name is Petty. And Petty loves to eat always eat so he loves to eat and petty he's a he's a funny guy he uh, make fun and laugh all the time okay and uh, petty also love to dance and having many friends uh, he play all the time never stop playing and petty he, he and Petty, they live in the same street. Every morning, eight o'clock, they meet, okay? And they go to school together as well, okay? And they have lots of many likes on the Facebook. And they stay together until the end. And they are true friends. They are good friends. This is what we conclude from the poem, my friend, okay? So, student, before we go to the questions and answer, I want you to read for me. Who is going to read the poem? Me. Okay, go ahead. Okay. My friend name is Peter. Uh -huh. He always says, I want to eat. Uh -huh. He is very funny and make me love he uh -huh. love to dance down the garden part uh -huh. he has ever so many friends uh -huh. he never knows when play time ends right. he lives he lives he lives at the he lives at the bottom of my street my so very good. So every day in the morning at eight we meet. Uh -huh. We run to school on a mountain bikes. 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 Yeah, bikes. And, uh -huh. and on Facebook we have lots of like. He stay with me until the end. Very he good. really is a true fan. Okay, very good. Okay, one more, another student who is going to read. Me, me. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> My friend's name is Peter. Uh -huh. He will say, I want to eat. 
He really funny and make me laugh. Mm -hmm. He love to dance down the garden path. Right. Very good. He has ever so many friends. Very good. He never knows when Pecham eats. Right. He lives at the bottom of my seat. Right. So every day in the morning at eight we meet. Uh -huh. We ride to school on our mountain bike. Very good. And on Facebook, we have a lot of likes. Uh -huh. we, we will stay with me, you need the aid. Right. He already is a two fan. Okay, that's very really good. Okay, one more student. Who is going to read? Come ahead. Who is going to read? Tunchaya, can you read that? My, my, my friend. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. He is a I want to eat. He is very funny. Very good. Yes. Never mind. Ends. Ends. Yes, very good. We sleep at the bottom of my feet. Very good. Good. On Facebook, we have lots of. All right. Like he says, it means he needs. Until the end, yes. Okay, very good. Okay, students. So this is the poem. We already understand the poem. The poem is about my friend. Now we will move toward the questions and answers. Okay. So here, <clears throat> choose the best answer. What is the poem about? So we have four options. A a family, B, a school, C, a friend, D, a house. So let me ask one by one. One, what is the poem about? A, a friend. Exactly, that is the correct answer. The poem is about a friend. Now, question number two. What kind of person is Petty? Let me ask from Quentin. Can you answer number two? A. Hey. A. What, a, uh, what kind of person is petty? So A, a good friend. Another option we have, a bad friend, a good brother, a bad brother. So he is actually a good friend. 
The correct answer is A. Now, here, uh, now we have some of the statement given to us, which is about the poem we already read. So, if the statement, A, uh, if the sentence is true, so we are going to write T. If the uh, sentence is false, the statement uh, written here is false, so we are going to write if. So, number one, Betty like to eat a lot. Is it true or false? Let me ask from Chao Kun. Chao Kun, he. number one. He. He. Adena? Yes. T. T. True. T. Yeah, that is the correct because we already read in the poem. Petty like to eat a lot. Number two, Petty is a serious boy. Is it true or false? Let me ask from Supercon. Is it true or false? False. False, because Petty is a funny guy. Number three, Petty likes to dance. Is it true or false? Let me ask from Pankton. Number Ooh. three, again, please. Ooh. True, exactly. Now, Question number four, uh, sentence number four. Uh, Petty has lots of friends. Let me ask from Fa. Is it true or false? Number four. Two. True, exactly. That is the true sentence. Now, sentence number five. That is, Petty loves to play. Is it true or false? Let me ask from Lily. Is it true or false? Can you answer sentence number five? Petty loves to play. Is it true or false? True. True, exactly. We already read in the poem, Petty loves to play. Playtime never ends, you remember? Okay, now sentence number six. They live in different street. Let me ask from Lemon. Lemon, can you answer? True. True. Your answer is? True. True. Okay. Now let me ask from another student. I didn't. Sentence number six. They live in different street. Is it true or false? Far. Exactly. We already read in the poem. They say they were talking. I pity live in the bottom of my street. So that means they live in the same street. So the sentence here, they live in different streets. It's false. Number seven. They meet at seven o'clock. Let me ask from Pinyapat. Is it true or false? Number seven. They live, uh, they meet at seven o'clock. Oh. 
false. Exactly. Because we already read in the poem, they meet at 8 every morning. Okay. Number 8. Sentence number 8. The boys go to school together. Is it true or false? Let me ask. Tongkla. Is it true or false? True. The, the boy goes to school together. It's true. Okay, that's very nice. All right, students, so all of you, you already note down in your notebooks, in your books already, the answers, true and false. Already done, students? Yes. Okay, now here. So now here we have uh, being a friend, actually. So we have some of the words given to us. So these words we have to use in the blanks, uh, blank spaces here. So uh, first of all, we would like to read the words which are given to us, the text. They are play, help, laugh, share, friend, forever, together, kind. Okay, so these are the words given to us. Now uh, we are going to read the text and we will fill the blank spaces with the most suitable word, okay? So the text given to us, that one is about being a friend. Number one, everyone needs a, then blank space. Number two, good peoples are blank space and make new friends. Number three, Friends make each other dash full stop. Number four, friends blank space together have fun. Number five, friends blank gap things, example food. Number six, good friends uh, blank space and each other when they are in trouble. Number seven, two friends stay, blank gap, okay. Number eight, real friends are dash. Okay, so now we are going to find the best word which we can put in the blank space. Number one, okay, everyone needs a let me ask first from Nana, can you answer what is the most suitable word for the blank space number one? Friend. Again, please. Friend. Friend, exactly. That is the correct answer. So everyone need friend. Number two. Good people are dash and make new friends. Let me ask from, let me ask from Supacon. Supacon, can you find the best word for number two blank space? Dun, 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 dun. Again, please. Your answer again, please. Number two, good people are. Others, answer please. Okay, 
Okay, let me move to another student. Mm, Pangton, can you answer number two? Good friends are dash and make new friends. What is the best word we can put here to complete the sentence? Again, please, I can't hear you. I not understand, Pankton. Can you answer a bit loud? Good people are? A. A, there is no A. <laughs> okay, so uh, let me complete that. Good people are kind, okay? Kind people, they are good, okay? So good people are kind and make new friends. Now, sentence, uh, now number three. Number three, we have friends make each other dish. What is the best answer here? Let me ask from... Put, can you answer that, please? Put number three. Put, can you hear me? Put your book on your book. What is your answer on book? You tell teacher, please. Okay, let me find, let me pass to another me, student. Me, 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 me. Uh, okay, go ahead. Friends make each other. Friends make each other. What is the upcoming word? Your answer, please. Help. Again, please. Help. Help. F friends make each other help. Ah, let me ask from another student. And then we will find the answer is correct or no. Now, let me ask from Panya. Can you answer? Number three. Awful. Okay, let me tell you, friends. Teacher, may... uh, teacher. Yes. Some student don't do it. Okay. All right. So friends make each other laugh. Like uh, we will find, we we have friends, right? So they make us happy. So the best. A uh, word we can use here is laugh, okay? Now, number four. So we already use three words of them. 
friend, kind, laugh. Okay. Now the remaining ones we have, we are going to answer among them. Number four, friends, dash together and have fun. Who can answer that? Just think. Don't hey. worry if your if your answer is wrong. No problem. You can hey. just give your hey. answer. Play. Right. That is the correct play. answer. Friends, play. friends, play together and have fun. Okay. Number five. Friends, dash things. Example, e.g., food. Who can answer that? Let me ask from Sunday. Your answer for number five, please. Uh, okay. Fresh. Uh, for, forever. Uh, forever, I think. Friends, forever things? You sure? No. 